Hello everyone, this is Dr. Ananya. Welcome to my channel. In today's video, we'll be talking about ANA, that is anti-nuclear antibody test. Before beginning the video, I'd like you to subscribe to my channel so that I can share all the valuable and useful information with you. First of all, let us know what is ANA test. An ANA is a test that looks for anti-nuclear antibodies in the blood. If the test finds that there are anti-nuclear antibodies in the blood, it may indicate that you have an autoimmune condition. An autoimmune condition or an autoimmune disorder may mean that your immune system may attack your own cells. These disorders can cause serious health problems and may also be fatal. So, what are antibodies? Antibodies are the proteins made by your immune system to fight off the foreign substances. But anti-nuclear antibody can attack its own cells, that is healthy cells. It is called anti-nuclear because it targets nucleus of the cell. Now let us know what is this test used for. An ANA test is used to diagnose autoimmune disorders. Some of the autoimmune diseases include SLE, scleroderma, and rheumatoid arthritis. Now, let us know why you may need this test. Your doctor might order this test if you have any signs or symptoms of autoimmune diseases. Some of the symptoms include fever, rash, muscle pain, joint pain, and a special red-colored butterfly-shaped rash. Now, let us see what happens during an ANA test. For this test, a small sample of blood is withdrawn from the vein of your arm. The sample is then collected and sent to the lab. The results usually come in 2-3 to three days depending on the lab. So, how do you prepare for this test? For this test, no special preparations are needed. It can be done as per patient's convenience. So, are there any risks to the test? As this test is very simple and very quick, there are almost no risks associated. But make sure the area is well cleaned and needle is sterilized. Now, let's come to the results. If your ANA test report is positive, it means there are anti-nuclear antibodies in the blood. You may get a positive result if you have SLE or other autoimmune diseases. Sometimes you can also get a positive result if you have any viral infections. A positive test does not necessarily mean that you have a disease or a health condition. Also, make sure you tell your doctor about all the medications that you are taking, including the OTCs. OTCs means over-the-counter medicines such as paracetamol. This is so because some medications can also alter the results. If a test is positive, your doctor might require additional tests to confirm the diagnosis. It is equally important for you to get tested from a reputed and reliable lab. If you have any questions or any suggestions, feel free to comment down below. Till then, stay safe and stay healthy.